Catching Every Fish in Minnesota, part four, the goldfish. To catch these guys, I'm fishing the small, shallow bay of a neighborhood pond. And in the spring, this area warms up from the sun and the goldfish swim in to absorb some heat. So using my polarized glasses, I've spotted a school of about 10 of them that are sitting right under the surface in the middle. And for bait today, I've got white bread and I'm rolling it into a bowl that's just big enough so that the bluegill can't eat it. Wild goldfish are closely related to carp and will smell the scent of the bread laying on the bottom. So it didn't take long before we had a bite. This one is a huge fat female and a little bit bigger than the average for this pond. There's actually not a Minnesota state record, but the biggest the DNR found was about 18 inches. It's important to know these guys are omnivores, so they'll eat corn, bugs, dog food, minnows, and you can even catch them on the fly. Tons of people have let their pets go in the wild around the USA. Some have been known to grow into the size of footballs. Don't do this, it's illegal. But even though these goldfish don't have any natural predators, there are still some giant fish that love to eat them. So let me know in the comments, what fish species should I catch next?